and the extra benefit is the control of sliding the motorcycle. In order to control a slide, you need to work from the pivot point, from the center of the motorcycle, and you need to have your upper body weight in front of the pivot point. When your weight is too far back, you're telling the rear wheel to hook up and go straight. And if you do manage to get it to slide, all of your weight is going to go with the slide instead of staying in front of it. Now you're making a combination of mistakes and the side effect is a loss of control. When it's done correctly, you're starting with your body weight in the center of the pivot point. Then when you move forward, you're putting more of your weight in front of the pivot point. This puts more weight on the front wheel for more traction and less weight on the rear wheel for less traction. You're telling the motorcycle to slide and you're partly controlling that slide with your upper body movements from in front of the pivot point.